Kathleen Clark gets off-season advice from Fever Aliya Boston after WNBA playoff loss. Indiana Fever season is over, guys. But basketball will remain the focus in the coming months. In the immediate aftermath of the Indiana Fever disappointing loss to the Sun on Wednesday night, which eliminated them from the WNBA playoff in a two-game sweep star rookie, Catherine Clark was asked about her post-season plans as it was established that she will not be heading overseas to play for any European club. Instead, Clark, who was not ready to answer questions about what is next so soon after the defeat, could only muster that she might play some golf. That's what I am gonna do until it's get too cold in Indiana. So I have got that become a professional golfer, Clark said. That's where teammate Celia Boston stepped in. Boston was last year Rookie of the Year in the WNBA and also helped show Clark the ropes over this season as the Loa phenomena worked her way into the pro game. So Boston had some advice on the golf, telling Clark, not too much babe, right, keep it basketball. Boston, who had 16 points and 19 rebounds in the game 2 lost in Connecticut, averaged 14 points with 8.9 rebounds and 3.2 assists in this season, earning her second All-Star selection. Like Clark, she landed with Indiana as the number one pick in the WNBA draft and helped a 5-win team in 2022 improve to 13 wins in 2023. So, this year that improvement accelerated and the fever wiped clean a 1-8 start and 120 games. Looking at this, looking at how far we can came from the start of the season to now, I'm just super proud of our group and I just cannot wait to see what the future holds," Boston said. That's why she wants to keep the focus on basketball this offseason. The Fever have made their way to point five hundred and into the playoff, but more will be required to continue moving to with the franchise forward. I think my rookie season, I think it was a rebuild year, Boston said. When you are looking to rebuild year, everyone wants to obviously jump to the championship and bring home a ring and everything. But I think when you look at a basketball as a whole, when you look at where you start to where you are now, it's about it's about stepping stones. I think in two seasons we made the right steps to go forward. And I am excited for that the future holds because we won 13 of my first year, now 20. We are on the rise and I think it's, I think it's important to keep that uh, as a focus. So guys, this is pretty much in the short but to the point audio podcast. And I hope you guys really like it. Can you do subscribe to our YouTube channel. And thank you so much for watching.